Hey guys, it's John with Geekbeat TV. We are continuing our live coverage here at CES 2013. We're at the Box Boot, and if you haven't heard of them, you definitely know many of their brands like RCA, Acoustic Research, and Clips. So let's take a look at some of their updates. Powered by the 2013 C-Max, the official car of CES. Okay guys, we're gonna start off with the MVP portable wireless speaker system. This is actually a pretty cool little device. It's about the shape of like, what, a little water cooler? You can get it with personalization. As you can see, just about any brand you want, you can order it. So if you're a Steelers fan, there you go. We're the Cowboys, right over there, go boys. Um, the cool thing about this is it's a Bluetooth speaker. It's pretty portable. Uh, you can actually uh, abuse it a little bit and uh, it uses six AA batteries. It'll last about a day. Sounds really good, actually. So great for tailgating parties or whatever you want. Let's head over and take a look at some of the other stuff. Okay, I know this looks like a light hanging here, but it's not. I want you to imagine one of those portable speakers repackaged into a really nice uh, you know, decor item here that you could hang on the outside or whatever. Come over here and take a look at these. This is a whole line of AR speakers. They, are, they come in different flavors. We've got a Bluetooth only version, so you could just pair it up with your phone and uh, uh, stream to it. These are uh, kind of waterproof. They're not waterproof, but they're definitely water resistant. You can leave them outdoors. Um, they also come in other versions. This is a 900 megahertz version. So let's say you want to have a party around the pool. You could plug in one uh, transmitter to your source device, and you could put 10 of these little puppies all around the pool. There's also a version, if you look right over here, that has uh, an auxiliary input, 900 megahertz, and you can even get one with Bluetooth, 900 megahertz, and auxiliary input. So they make it in many different flavors. The price point on these is around 100 bucks. Um, and you'll be able to find them pretty soon, at least, in major outlets. Hey, did you know that NPR's award-winning public radio app is one of the many apps that you can control with your voice via Ford Sync App Link. Connect a supported mobile phone to your Ford vehicle via Sync App Link, and before you know it, you're going to be able to stream local news, listen to your favorite programs like Morning Edition and All Things Considered, and navigate through custom playlists, all using simple voice commands. Sync App Link is yet another example of how Ford is going further to keep you connected on the go. Thanks so much to Ford for powering our CES coverage. Okay, this one is really cool. Now, this is a really low price point item, but it's very, uh, it's got a very unique feature I've never seen before. So I've got my little Galaxy Note here and I'm playing some music, you hear it? Okay, so what we're gonna do is place the phone on this little on this little radio so what it's doing is it's basically taking the output from the speaker here and it goes right on this which which hears it and amplifies it through there so it's a great little clock radio that you could use your uh, Android or iOS phone it'll work with anything and there's a USB port on the side so you can power your device while it lays there overnight so charge it up and have it wake you up much louder than the phone is capable of in the morning speaking of louder I want to show you a brand new line of speakers they've got called Stream. Okay, you guys have heard us talking about the Sonos. We love Sonos. It's great because it allows you to put amplified speakers in different rooms and have them play different sources and control them from a smartphone, etc. Well, Stream is actually a serious competitor to the Sonos product out there. What you've got is a nice little compact amplified stereo or you know speaker system here it's got uh, basic controls on the top and you can control it with an app on your smartphone just like you would other competitive things um, the uh, big difference here is that you can buy a three pack of these stream units for about 600 bucks if you want to go with the individual ones they'll probably be around 250. now these aren't out just yet so pricing is not absolutely finalized but very soon you're gonna be able to get a hold of Stream if you'd like to kind of go that route. All right, that's a lot of updates here from Vox. You guys stay tuned for more coverage here from CES. Head on over to geeky.tv forward slash, no, 
YouTube.com forward slash GeekBeatTV. Give us a thumbs up if you like it. We'll see you later.